It's Christmas time, and we're here at Rachel Rhodes to make a bird wreath. Bird seed. Bird seed wreath. Same thing. So, some really simple ingredients. You need some unflavored gelatin. Non, what is this? Cooking spray? Right? Yeah. <laughs> Light caro syrup, bird seed, and flour. So what do we do? So you take your one flavor packet, and then you're gonna take a half a cup of warm water. So that your gelatin dissolves. And then you mix. Is it dissolved? To make the jello, you're going to stir it at a 90 degree angle. <laughs> and then after that, you're going to add in three fourths a cup of flour. So it's gonna form like a, a icky What'd you give me here? A fourth. So it looks almost like biscuit dough, almost. So after you add the flour and you mix it really well, you wanna add three tablespoons of light corn syrup to your mixture. And then you just mix, keep on mixing. And then now it's time for your bird seed. So you're gonna do four cups of bird seed. And you can do a bird seed mix of black oil sunflowers, some cracked corn, um, some Milo, and then mix it all up. And we like to do that mixture so that it attracts a variety of, of birds, not just, you know, one specific. <laughs> you might want to use your spatula now. Yeah, I was... Because it's... I gonna, wanted to show people what not to do. Yeah, and it's going to form like a really gooey kind of mixture. And you just want to make sure you get all that flour incorporated um, so that it sticks nicely in your bun pan. All right, so after that's done and mixed, you want to spray your bun pan with your um, nonstick cooking spray. Yeah, good yeah. job. Yeah, nice I, feel, I feel the need of that. And then you just dump it in your bird, in, in your bun. In my bird? In your bird. I just dump it in the bird. <laughs> just dump, just it, dump it, it right in the bird. Like when you make a bunt cake, you wanna make sure that it's, you know, evenly spread through that bunt pan. And then you wanna kind of press it down so that it's evenly distributed. If you want to use your hands, that's fine too. Press it down? Yeah, so it's nice and firm, so it sticks. And then you're gonna let it sit about 24 hours, and then it will pop out, and it should pop out nice and easily. And then you can put a ribbon or a string of baling twine around it and hang it up in your tree for your birds. This would be a really great Christmas gift, you know, a DIYer. It doesn't cost very much to make, and it can help our bird population. We have 400 different species of native birds in Maryland, and it's a really good habitat for overwintering birds. And, you know, birds need something to eat during the winter. They don't have their flowers or seeds outside, so this is a great substitute for them. So it's a rare win-win-win. Yeah. So go to the store, buy all these easy products, we'll list yep. them again for you, and make a bird seed wreath. Oh, you got it right! I got it right! I can't ha- oh. Yeah! <laughs>